and gentlemen, good morning. Welcome to the Digital Wellbeing Symposium held by NUS Center for Trusted Internet and Community and Media Literacy Council. Uh, it means and it involves viewing us not just as individual citizens, digital citizens, but uh, digital citizens having also uh, the capacity to develop their human potential over the time. Parents underestimate uh, the kinds of online harms that children face online and consequently as a result of that, you know, it's uh, also very difficult to talk about it. We need to raise awareness of online risk and the reality of exposure to this risk. We need to support parents in mitigating online risks that their children may face. Because as parents, right, we need all the help that we can get. Our first line of help uh, that we hope we get from are uh, the social media companies themselves, right? I love how City put together the program. Uh, Dr. Tang and uh, Professor Ye talked to me. Uh, gave a very good breakdown and landscape of what's happening online for Singapore. I think it's great because a lot of uh, information that you can find online is about other countries, so what the US is doing, Australia. They have really good insights about how parents in Singapore are managing and the reality like, with what's happening with the children here. Yeah, I think that, that was one of the more fun aspects where you really get to hear the opinions, the different opinions from everyone. Um, everyone comes from different backgrounds, different um, experiences, so they, they were really able to contribute. I think it's very useful. So for the first time that, um, that I hear about it, right, it's not theory. It's not like a theory that they just tell you and therefore that's it, you know. But however, I think it's very exciting. Something that I feel is pragmatic that parents can use. 